Om Gyan Timaram Dasya Gyanandana Salakya Saksur Minitam Yenatus Mai Sigurave Namaha Bancha Kalpatru Vyacha Kripa Sindubye Vyacha Patitanam Pavanevyo Vaisnavevyo Namo Namaha Once Maharaj Pariksit was roaming his kingdom and came across a terrible scene. A scene where a cow had been attacked by some low class dark man dressed like a king who had with a stick broken the legs of a bull. Maharaj Pariksit, being a valiant king, immediately took action and was ready fight that man in the royal dress, none other than Kali personified. Kali, instead of fighting, immediately fell at the feet of the king like a subordinate, not ready to fight. Maharaj Pariksit took full action said Kali could not stay in the kingdom. Kali, Kali said, what will I do? I took shelter. I am Praja. I exist. I've taken birth. I need to exist somewhere. Where can I exist? Maharaj Pariksit thought, said, you can stay in four places. There, where there is gambling, meat eating, illicit sex, and intoxication. There was no such place. Kali, couldn't find such a place, so came back and said, where will I stay? Then Maharaj Pariksit said, okay, you can stay where gold is stored. From this 16th chapter of Srimad Bhagavatam. Srila Prabhupada phrased the four regulative principles, which he formally introduced for his followers. As Srila Prabhupada was preaching to the modern world, he spelled it out, what to follow to become free from the influence of the age of Kali. Then, Mahaprabhu gave the Yuga Dharma, the chanting of the Holy Name. And not only that, Katanshana Smite Yasmin Duskaram Sukaram Bhavit, he also added his mercy 
and made what is difficult easy. And so, the fundamental tenets of Krishna consciousness for the modern world took shape. 16 rounds minimum and four regulative principles. You all are the fortunate people because you all came in touch with transcendental knowledge and with Vaishnavas. And as a result, you took up this process of Sadhana Bhakti, chanting Hare Krishna, and following four regulative principles. Who in this world, who in this world is prepared to live like that? But by Srila Prabhupada's and his followers' inspiration, we were ready. You were ready. You became the heroes. You're walking a heroic path, most glorious. Everything is blessed on the way. Nothing could be better. What a wonderful life have you been given? So I am very glad that I could be instrumental to inspire you to remain on that path. And through my written, recorded words, recorded kirtan, and all else that remains behind, through the memories in your heart, I will continue to inspire you to stay on this path through thick and thin. When all is blissful, when all is struggle, do not waver. It is you got the greatest treasure. Never forget. Nowhere in this world is there such wealth. The wealthiest man in the world is a pauper. You have the real wealth. Treasure it. Relish it. Cherish it. Hold it close. Hold it close. Don't become slack, neglectful. Hold it close. Chant every day. Hear every day. Carve these principles in stone. <sighs> Let them be. There every day, and your life will be wonderful. And at the end, go back to Godhead, and we can physically reunite and celebrate there like we've never celebrated before. So looking forward 
to the great, great festival that is to come, where all of us will together and celebrate to another dimension, where the bliss will rise to levels never seen, never heard of. That time is not far away. Life is short, Prabhupada said, just give this one life to me. Please do that, just give it, and everything will become most amazing. Saying to, I'm saying goodbye to you for just a short time. For when we will be, I'll stay with you in my words and memories. I'll be with you on the path. And I'm waiting for you on the other end to meet you again in person. Soon, soon, miracles will happen. Soon, we will see love. We will see bliss. We will see fulfillment beyond our imagination, beyond our expectation. Remember Dhruva, when he met the Lord, all his previous expectations, he said, they're like broken pieces of glass. You gave me jewels. All we ever desired were broken pieces of glass. The Lord will give us jewels. Oh, stay on the path. Don't get lost. Come quickly. Let us join this festival of, of Krishna. The festival of unlimited, ever-growing love. Thank you. Hare Krishna. i uh-huh.